We're going to talk a lot about the IPCC, but I think first it's important for you to know who is the IPCC or what is the IPCC. IPCC stands for the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change. This panel was established by the United Nations Environment Program and the World Meteorological Organization, and it was established in 1988. So relatively early, um, if we think about how fast things have gone in the research on climate change in the recent decades. And so many of you don't realize this, this government panel has been around for a, a few decades already. Um, the goal of this panel was to provide the world with a clear scientific view on the current state of knowledge in climate change and its potential environmental and socioeconomic impacts. And so it really has two different fo foci. It's supposed to be looking at environmental science and what's happening, what's the science behind changes in the environment, and then how is that impacting uh, social and economic environments, if you will, around the world. So how is it impacting people? How is it impacting societies? How is it impacting even geography? So the IPCC, they review and assess the most recent scientific, technical, and socioeconomic information. They do not generate their own studies. So they basically are a place where scientists get together and they review all of the literature out there on a topic that's related to climate change and then they come to a consensus based on all the different articles and studies that they've reviewed. And then they publish that consensus in uh, documents that can go to policymakers or scientists around the world so we know what's the latest research showing. Membership, to, membership in the IPCC is open to all member countries of the United Nations and the World Meteorological Organization, WMO. And so the United States is a member of IPCC, and it's one of 195 different countries that are members of the IPCC. So this governing body um, really, it doesn't really govern as much as provide information, but it's, um, it includes scientists and professionals from many countries around the world. Um, also, thousands of scientists participate in the IPCC, and like I said, they're from all of the different member countries around the world contributing to the work. And so it's not just a small group of scientists. This is a large group of scientists who are um, leaders in the field of atmospheric science or economics or sociology.